welcome back to my channel I am so excited because I've got another shopping haul that I want to share with you all if you're new hello and welcome and if you're returning thank you for coming back thank you for watching my videos I am so excited so the shops today I have Superdrug, Primark, Poundland and Home Bargains okay <laughs> I don't really travel anywhere else like these are kind of like my shops that I just love to kind of like you know just pop in and just see what they have which is a big mistake for someone like me because I end up leaving with stuff you know that's unless I don't see anything that I like I am going to push on the first shop that I am going to show you is going to be home bargains I had to think about that I really had to think about that but it's going to be home bargains okay and the first item i'm going to show you is the garnier um water cleanser now i thought i had a bargain like 99p with a mascara no when i got to the counter it was four pounds so i was a bit disappointed that it was four pounds and it wasn't a bargain that i thought it was it comes with a maybelline great lash very black mascara and if you saw my other video you, you know i mentioned that you know i thought i had all these mascaras and i like looked like oh no i don't i also purchased this lovely rose gold compact mirror and there's a reason why i bought this um let me just show you it's got this lovely kind of jewel type at the front yes it's actually it's almost like a mirror in itself to be fair oh my gosh oh wow it makes it gives my face such a lovely rosy glow it's like who needs makeup and you've got this mirror here you know it's like saying mirror mirror on the wall who's the fairest of them all you just look in the mirror and this is you anyway so i got that and got a little button that you push open and then you've got a nice little compact mirror inside this was $1.99 next I bought this cute little tin here this, was like, <laughs> this tin was like 79p um, and I had a, they had a couple of little other items but I just picked up this tin it's so cute it's got this lovely lovely um, flowers printed all over the tin um, it comes right off there's no hinge so it just comes right off and inside is like so so in here you can put you know all manner of things moving along i purchased this lovely sweet pea and rose a can luxury fragrance candle by whitford and co this was 59 pence i mean look at this it's not filled right to the top it you know there's a little bit of a gap you see the wick and this was really really nice i am um, haven't lit this yet you've got all your warning and instructions and stuff like this but it has a really really nice smell i then purchased this a bigger one by whitford and Cole, apricot blossom this was 2.99 it's a lovely peach color mm. it's a really really strong smell yeah the throw is really strong when it's cold but let's just see you know how strong the throw is when i actually like these babies i mean three pounds for this big candle you know like candle this size with you know you're talking 15 20 25 pounds sometimes in some places yeah so but what's important is how strong this throw is if it's not strong then it's two pound 99 wasted uh and that's it i'm gonna move on to poundland okay now i went to i i went to two pound land shops i went there and they're shutting down unfortunately so there's a lot of stuff that's like 25 percent off and I'm gonna start with these um, as I've mentioned before you know I do handmade cards and stuff and I love these type of backing papers I'm not gonna go through it all I, and this one's called enchanted Christmas it's a design pad 32 sheets 200 GSM and then I got um, pure frozen all of these are the same again I think I've, I've, I've um, bought these before previously if you watch my other hauls and this one is called contemporary christmas so they're all christmas ones that's the ones that they had next i purchased these you, again in my other videos if you check my videos i purchased this this is to go um in my bedroom in a nice um faux velvet vase that i bought from poundland also these were reduced to silly silly prices maybe 50p or something like that each so i bought three of those also in the pound shop i purchased this candle which is lavender blossom by starlight and this smells really really nice moving on to pound land the one that's my second local shop um which is just you know still stuff still a pound there's no big discounts there 
I got this rechargeable USB multi charger cable for Android phones and iPhones. I haven't opened it yet, I don't know how good they are, but I thought, you know what, it's a pound. Something like this you can just try, and if it doesn't work, you just bin it. Power bank, um, compatible with most phones, a power bank for a pound. Now, I don't know how good this is. I, I don't know, I haven't tried it, I just bought it. Um, I just, again, I'm just losing everything. There's this small power bank right here. So I'll probably do a review actually on these. Um, I just drop the uh, here's the cable thing here. Yeah. So um, I'm gonna power this up. I'll probably do a review and just see how well you know this charges up and charges my phone and stuff like that. Cause that'd be quite interesting. I purchased these. Um, let me take this out so you can actually see these little bins. You know when you go to some restaurants and give you chips in these little buckets. If you see my last video, I was talking about um, hosting a dinner party and I bought those chip baskets and I said the next I'm going to get um, the Pels. Well, anyway, in the pound shop, they had these for a pound each and they had a whole load and I said, you know what, I did not pass go, I did not collect £200, I just literally picked up eight and I stuffed it in my basket because I thought, if I leave these, I am not going to see them again. Moving on to my favourite shop one of my favorite shops Wilco's if you saw my last video I was talking about you know having a dinner party um, later on in the year and with that I want to um, I purchased some of these chip baskets um, I purchased another two so I've got four purchased another two and I just got two more to collect these are chrome plated and here's a picture of it here if you can see that yeah so these are at two pounds each I then purchased these soft decorative sands and I was thinking about um, I've got some lovely um, vases and stuff you know you want to decorate with sand and dirt and stuff like that and I was thinking about it thinking about it and guess what they had it in Wilco's who knew I never knew and I'm sure I walked past that section because they're near the candle section and I've never seen this before um, or maybe I just might not have noticed it these soft sand I got one white and one sand color guess how much guess how much one pound each I could not believe it. I said this is about 1028 grams minus the container just say 126 grams you know I doubt it's cost two grams but just say 1026 grams for these that's pretty heavy for a pound pretty good next up I bought this fresh cotton and lily pillar candle this was 150 I love um, fresh cotton and lily smells I really really do love that fresh 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 smell they got a big one for two pound fifty but I just bought one of these I bought one of these because I want to do a candle review, um, you know, like candles that's lasting, how long they last, just the throw and all the rest of it. So watch that, watch out for that on my blog. It has 25 hours of burn time. This is fresh cotton and lily. Alongside that, I couldn't resist, I saw these little tea light holders here for £2 each. They are so lovely. And if you have a little dinner party or if you want to decorate your fireplace or you know a shelf or whatever these look so so nice two pounds each and they're quite heavy as well they look really, really good i'm gonna move on to a little beauty purchase i've done some purchases of some beauty products and i'm going to start off with essence i love extreme crazy volume mascara i if you see my videos if you see my blogs i you know i really do like the um essence the gel nail polish and I've you know I'm building up slowly building up a small collection of colours of those. I haven't bought a mascara and this is it. This is, has a straight wand. It's quite thick. You can see that it's really thick on that. I'm just doing this with a uh, mirror. I don't even know if you look, can see that really. Shall I zoom in? Yeah let's zoom in. Oops. Oh wow you can see the difference already. Okay let me focus up. Right, I did this quite blindly. Wow, you can see? Oh wow, this is amazing. Oh my goodness me. This is really good. I like it. This is good. Look at that. Look at that. Look at me with my non-lashes. You know, my lashes are so non-existent. Look at it. Look. Lashes are supposed to, you know, protect your eyes from 
you know, debris and whatever. And the, my, my eyelashes ain't protecting nothing. Look at it. You can't even see it. Zooming in, you can barely see no anything. Anyway, look at this. Look at the difference. Oh my goodness me. Look at that. I am in love. I am. Oh. I am in love. Look at this. I mean, you saw how I started to put it on without a mirror and I was just guessing where my eyelashes are. And look how thick that is. This is amazing. £2.80 for this lovely mascara by Essence. I love extreme crazy volume mascara. Look at my eye. Look at my eye and excuse my beauty spot that I just put on there as well. Look at it. Mmm. Mmm. I love it. I like it. Should I do the other one or should I just leave it? You know, my bottom lashes are even finer than my top ones. You know, like look, you can't. It's like I'm bald. Like I have no lashes at all. So I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna close my eyes. So you kind of saw the before and after anyway. So yeah, I'm really, really like. Let's zoom out now. There's nothing of this close-up business. Okay, yeah. So oh my gosh, two pounds eighty for this. I love it. Now on to my favourite, like my nose, look at my nose, it's disgusting, it's been chipped off and stuff like that, you know what I mean, I've been sitting there picking at it, that looks really bad, doesn't it, I oh, know, it needs doing. I'm going to move on to the nail varnish now, so I purchased three, I'm going to start off with this dark purple hair, this is in the colour Party Nights, 161, 1001 Party Nights, I think that's all of it, that's the name of it, this is the colour this is so nice this was actually the first color I picked up um, I saw it had a nice little pearl sheen to it this one is 04 our sweetest day that is that color uh, the third color I bought was this lovely lovely gorgeous lemon or yellow color it's a really nice pastel shade this is 38 love is in the air okay so actually should have, it should have been called spring is in the air because the daffodils are going to start coming up you know if they haven't come up already you know in some place actually i think some of mine have come up start to come up but daffodils are going to start coming up and i know this isn't the like, actually there are some daffodils that's got slightly lighter yellow but that should have been called um daffodils are in the air or something like that you know but hey um, that's it this is nice i can't wait to try these oh my goodness me Anyway, that is it from Wilco, and I'm going to move on to my last shop, which is Primark. This is called Petuni and Tonka Bean Scented Candle and burns after 30 hours. It's nice. I need to burn this, and hopefully the throw when I burn it is going to be amazing. So I've got this larger one for £4 and the smaller one for £2.50. I have never used these before. When I put on my makeup, I just use my normal brush and I kind of paint on the uh, I literally just paint on my foundation I think it's the artist in me I just say hey it's a canvas let me just add some color and stuff on it like I'm doing some kind of abstract art oh this brush is so soft it's like a, little, it's like a cat meow, meow. it feels really really nice yeah I want to try it I can't wait to try this actually okay so this is my little tiny one um they had a size in between this and this as well but I thought you know what this is quite all right for my face and get this so when I want to get in here or underneath my eyes, this will be perfect. Why am I, I feel like I'm so far away from everybody? You know, I don't want to be super, super close, so I feel like I'm far away. Yeah, so I've got these. This was £4, this was £2.50. And also, you know, if you see my Instagram, you know I love my perfumes. You know, I do like perfume. So anyway, moving on, I purchased some perfume. I wanted to get all these kind of smaller ones, these handbag size ones, but I only managed to, um, I wanted to get a handbag in this one called PS Love Noir, but it didn't have any. Um, so I just had to buy the big bottle, which was only £3.50. Uh, well, the, the box is actually bigger than the actual perfume itself. So this is what the box looks like. This is PS Love Noir. Yeah, so I took this just from the PS range that they have. This is a bottle. It's just nice, simple, nothing, you know, fancy or anything like that. Yeah, it's got the PS Love Noir. And the scent on this is absolutely gorgeous. Now, I'm going to do a little review on these perfumes. Oh, this is really, mm, this is really, really, really nice. It's got um, a bit fruity. Mmm, 
I need to let it dry for a bit. You know when you put too much on and it kind of like, you're getting all that alcohol smell and everything. So what they have in this is a deeply sensual blend of rich dark florals, sweetie seductive, ah, praline and vanilla musks. The next perfume is Polka Eau de Toilette. These are two pounds. These are 10 mils, uh, 0.33 fluid ounces. So here it is, this book. This is so nice, black and gold, gold and black. Oh, it's roll on. Oh my gosh, I thought it was going to be a little spray, so I didn't, did not realize. Oh, this is nice. Okay, let's just put some. Oh, oh, this is nice. So let's have a little read. Uh, this one doesn't have any description like that one. This one is scandal. Oh, by the way, this is two pounds. Yeah, and this is two pounds as well. Um, this is called Scandal, with a little sexy lips at the bottom there. Um, this one says, a fresh oriental fragrance with green mandarin, boosted by the floral essence of ginger lily and jasmine. The sensual and luminous vanilla accord brings an addictive ma magnetism. Gosh, my eyesight is gone. My eyesight used to be so good. If you're wondering why I look different, it's because this morning I checked in my Primark bag because I wanted to put something in there and I found another bottle of perfume for two pounds. They have, um, all of these that I'm showing you, they all have bigger bottles as well. It does have aqua, aquamarine written on it, but it's, it's really fine. So I don't know if you can see that, you can catch the glow, you can see the glare of the gold. Oops. And it's a roll on. And it actually smells really nice and fresh. It really, really is. I'd advise you to put a little bit and then like maybe just a stroke and then see how it goes. If you put too much, it can be quite overpowering. But it's really, really nice. And this is two pound in Primark. <laughs> Sorry. Anyway, thank you everyone for watching. If you're new, hello and welcome again. And if you're returning, I appreciate you. And thank you very much for continuing to watch my videos. Watch out for my blog on my candles. I'm gonna be testing them and seeing you know how they are and giving some ratings and stuff like that because i do like candles uh, i'm waffling on i've got to edit this video because this is probably like 100 minutes long stay tuned again check me out check my blog out i you know i write various stuff like inspirational stuff motivational stuff as well as uh, you know a couple of reviews and stuff and my videos are at the moment mainly shopping hauls um but i have got some um diys my bullet journal oh, my nail just broke my nail just broke I do have some videos um, on my bullet planner, which I just kind of like, just made up, you know, in my bullet journal. Again, check out my Instagram because I do post and I'm doing a series called Month of Love. You know, it's about loving yourself, appreciating yourself and stop being hard on yourself and stuff like that. I'll leave a link below and so you can just click on it. So until then, I shall see you later and thank you for tuning in.